Hi traders, uh, Crispin here from FX Argo Trader. It's uh, the 4th of June 2020, so haven't posted a uh, video for a long time. Um, been busy uh, developing quite hard actually in the old COVID era. So uh, anyway, this is what I've been up to. Um, it's a new approach. It's called MA Universal. Um, doesn't look like much, does it, on this chart? But um, what we have is um, an indicator called FXA MA Universal. The clever bit is this interface here. And what this allows me to do is set up twin and triple moving average uh, alert monitors for any asset which is quoted in MT4. So let's just move this window over a bit and resize it so we can just keep an eye on what's going on in our market watch here. And obviously this is all the stuff which is quoted on this platform. The idea behind um, behind this is it allows us to essentially add any asset straight into this table above. So let's say for example we, we want, to, want to monitor cable, sterling US dollar on a 15 minute time frame. We want to know when the 10 period moving average crosses the 20 period moving average and we'll also put in a long term filter of 100 period moving average and we want to know when the moving average is touch rather than actually print a physical cross and we've set up our machine time which is my local time on my machine here is 1708 our broker time uh, is two hours ahead and I can alter that here as you can see with this spinner parameter I've, I'm sending alerts to my mobile phone uh, they're push notifications and if I submit that alert data you can then see that alert had just gone through here uh, created 17.09 and uh, 6 seconds so just now and it's just confirming everything we've done you've got full control over the visibility of this table so I can resize things, change background colours text colours, uh, I can modify widths of tables I can add in more information if I want I'm, at the moment I'm hiding the method and calculation price for the moving averages just to keep the table small I don't want it to be too engulfing. Um, you probably need a decent sized monitor to run this system, ideally a multiple monitor setup so you can kind of put your your interface over on the other monitor which I would do normally and then I'd be able to watch my charts and all the rest of it. But for the purposes of this demo I'm just going to set up some twin moving average crossovers so and show you how what happens when they're triggered. So that's just set up a euro dollar uh, one period and five period moving average with no three period moving average push notifications touch base crossover submit that same for cable let's put another one for dollar yen and another one for Aussie dollar US dollar and another one for US dollar Swiss franc let's put a user defined system and we're just getting an, an alert triggered there for the US dollar Swiss franc as you can see let's stick in one for uh, Nikkei 225, so that's JPN 225, same thing there, we just added that using our user defined assets, we can put in what else is happening, we've got uh, French index, they're calling that the FRA40 on this platform, this is an FXCM platform, I've just edited, put two in accidentally, I can delete one, you'll see these alerts being triggered, the noise you heard just a second ago was the push notification going to my phone and what I've done is I've set my phone up with a mobile uh, Android based MetaTrader 4 app and then set up if I go into MT4 and go under options and under notifications I use this notification code and stick that into the mobile MetaTrader device so if I test that now yeah, there we go that's better so that's all working nicely. That's how you set up your um, push notifications in MT4. So this is a super quick and powerful way of setting up and monitoring twin and triple moving average crossover alerts on any number of assets which are in your MT4 platform. Um, ideally, I'd like to wait until a few more of these alerts are triggered. And we just had our DAX, sorry, our CAC 40 alert trigger and we can check it if we want so we're looking at one minute time frame let's load up the CAC 40 chart 
and I've got a template here which has got the one and five minute moving averages on there. Well, it's got a one minute chart. Yes, you can see it's essentially that literally a minute ago you saw that it's probably a touch base crossover. Let's just check our alerts. Yeah, so we got touchdown FRA 40, and that was at 12, sorry, 1912 and 51 seconds. I don't have that granularity in MT4, but you can see that touch ended up being a, will be actually in the next minute, a full physical cross down. So there you go, folks. There's a lot going on there. Um, I didn't want to do a terribly long video, but uh, this, I think this is a pretty exciting tool. It's a lovely bit of integration between MT4 and Java, Java FX in this case. The really beautiful thing, see some alerts being triggered now. We've got our, so we've got our dollar yen alert and also our euro dollar alert being triggered now, both 1914.01 and 1914.02. So pretty granular, um, powerful, really easy to set up because you don't have to worry about multiple indicators all over MT4. You can run this whole thing from one chart and you've got one interface, i.e. the JavaFX interface, one chart and a ton of power uh, as you can see so pretty cool very configurable remembers what you've done getting another alert there Let's see what we've got so that's uh, yeah we got a Nick A225 triggered I'll just just to close the video off I'll show you that now so Charles template whoops template MA and go to one minute and there you go that's your touch um, Check our interface for that. So we on the Nikkei 225, 19, 14, and 42 seconds. It's telling us we've got a touch down. So 19, 14, there you see that touch going down there. So hopefully, guys, um, there's been a lot of work, a lot of code in here, um, mainly actually on the Java side. The MT4 side was actually pretty um, compact. But to get all this um, working in Java was 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 quite a quite a bit of work, and um, yeah, to, to just to, just to get the presentation and the configuration that I was really looking for, I want it to be really usable, uh, really quick to, to to deploy. I wanted lots of control over colors, style, or well, not so much styles, but what's displayed, what's not displayed, the colors, uh, background colors, text colors, and also control over the the column displays widths etc etc so I'm trying to make this as as usable as possible so that the actual user experience is strong um, so anyway I'll do some more videos on this there is a also an alert, alert sound function where you can generate um, local alert sounds um, which can be unique for each each asset that you actually want to track um, you can also schedule your, alert, your alerts as well so that they can start and finish on specific dates uh, and that they run from uh, the beginning of the day i.e. one minute past 12 at night through to 23.59 that day so if you do 4.06.20 at start 4.06.20 end it will run from one minute past midnight in the, in the early hours of the morning through to 23.59 the, the same day I'm going to be putting this on the website soon and um, it's going to be available to purchase. Um, if you've got any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me, info at fxalgotrader.com. The website address for this is www.fxalgotrader.com. You can see it here um, and you can get in touch using info at fxalgotrader.com and if you'd like to subscribe to the video please don't uh, hesitate to, um, to do so thanks very much for watching